Guys, in this video, I want to talk about Snapchat and the new feature called My AI and how you can actually get it. So, first of all, what you need to know is that you need to have your Snapchat installed, account ready, and all the stuff. However, if you open up Snapchat, this feature is not going to be available to you right away. And for this, you're going to have to subscribe to Snapchat Plus. So, if you go to your profile picture right there, the very first option is the Snapchat Plus. And My AI is one of the important things in here. So, you can subscribe for like 50, uh, 50 cents, it's not even that much, a month, and you can cancel anytime or pay yearly for like six bucks and of course once everything just gets through once the payment processes you can see we are all set now as you can see i am now subscribed to the snapchat plus you can do all the stuff the tap on it done and the very first thing right here is my ai that that actually pops up so in the snapchat plus section there is the my ai so you can turn it on like this and as you can see it is pinned that means that it is like enabled and stuff so the first chat is going to be at the my ai and you can click on accept and now you can actually use this feature so what is it really it is basically an unreal virtual friend that you can talk to and it also uses ai generated answers and it is supposed to sound like human you are supposed to have like a human conversation with it which i don't know if you want to use it or not but this, this is just how it works and this is what it is right now you can ask it to do certain things well on the official snapchat website they uh, are instructing you on what you can actually use it for and the thing says that my ai can answer a trivia question offer advice on the perfect gift for your bff's birthday help plan a hiking trip and stuff like that so some interesting topics you can ask it some things like what is the best way to surprise my best friend for birthday let's start with this kind of example and you can see that the answer is really quick it like generates it really fast you could plan a surprise party and I mean, it's going to be like a very generic kind of stuff. I mean, I haven't tested it thoroughly, but this is pretty much how you can enable it, how you can turn it on and you can now play with the AI. Of course, there are different AI models on um, the internet, but this one is integrated into Snapchat. So again, this is something that you may want to use. But one very important thing you should know is uh, the data announcement from Snapchat themselves. Because your interaction, and I'm quoting this, your interaction with my AI and a city level locations will be used by my AI. Your data will be used to improve AI and any other Snap products, including ads, to make them more personal and relevant to you. So this pretty much means that the information and that the text that you type in here, well, the AI is going to learn your behaviors, your preferences, and it can actually serve you better ads. So that's also a good point for a Snapchat. That's like a great way for them to make money because that's like the revenue model. I'm not saying they're bad for it. I'm not saying that uh, this is like a bad practice, but you should know about it. You, of course, have to accept the terms and conditions, and I'm pretty sure that it is part of it. But uh, this is uh, also very important information. So if you're not okay with this, you're going to have to skip using the My AI. So that would be about it. Hope the video helped you out. I really do think that you should subscribe to Fox Tech for more tutorials because I think you're going to find it valuable. And also check out the next video right here, which, again, in my opinion, is going to be useful to you. So thanks all for watching. See you guys later.